Hi, today I'm going to show you how to play the intro of Sweet Child of Mine by Guns N' Roses on this iPhone app called A Plus MIDI Guitar, the first and only true MIDI guitar controller for the iPhone, iPod Touch, and iPad. Okay, so to control the instruments on your computer, you need to run a server called DS MIDI Wi-Fi Server, and you can get it from Google. And then, on your computer, run your favorite digital audio workstation like GarageBand or Logic. Okay, I'm using Native Instruments Contact Player which is a free version of their flagship program. Okay, so run your server, run your program, and then connect this to the router using Wi-Fi, and then connect your router to your computer using a LAN cable, which will improve performance. So I highly recommend using a cable instead of Wi-Fi on your computer. Okay, for PC users, you need to run a software called Loop B. So L-O-O-P-B-E, okay? So, uh, then I'm going to shake my phone to go to settings and then make sure you set this hammer on timer to be always on and that becomes a tap mode that means you can just tap on each fret and they make a sound you don't need to strum okay and then on your computer select the instrument the distorted E guitar and then make sure you set the MIDI channel to Omni so it picks up all the strings and then set uh, solo mode to be on and that's good for playing solos what that does is it mutes the other strings while you're playing one string and that's very good for reducing noise okay and then to play this solo this intro you have to be you know at the the 12th fret so you're gonna move your hand down the fretboard okay so on the iPhone on this program the way you do that is you hold down the string down here by the you know on top of the sound hole and then you swipe from the fret you want to go to so now I'm at fret 11 okay this is fret 12 okay S string one will give you a you know fret one two three four uh, two three four five string two will move you down to you know six seven eight nine and then this one will move to uh, 10 11 12 13 so now I'm at uh, fret number 12 so you can see that right let's see if you can read that it says hand at fret 12 okay so once you got that let's start with the tutorial so there are four patterns in this song actually three the last pattern is the same as the first one okay so they all you know are pretty much the same except for the first note so the first pattern you start with 12th fret fourth string okay so this is the 12th fret now because I've moved down okay <laughs> And the next note is 4th fret, 2nd string. Next note, 3rd fret, 3rd string. 1st fret, 3rd string. 4th fret, 1st string. 3rd fret, 3rd string. 3rd fret, 1st string. Back to third fret third string okay so the pattern goes like this okay okay try not to lift your fingers too quickly it's gonna sound very choppy so instead you know apply the next finger before you let go the, the previous one so like this Okay, so the second pattern just starts with a different note. It starts with third fret, fourth string, right and everything else is the same. So, the third pattern start with first fret, third string. Play every pattern twice. Okay, and the last pattern is the same as the first one. Okay, and that's the first cycle. The second cycle repeats itself. And here.
hear it for the fourth pattern you're gonna play it once and then end it with this it's just the first fret first string fourth fret second string first fret first string third fret first string and that's it <laughs>